Hi, excuse me. I noticed you have a child. Me too. Can we sit together so they can talk to each other and not us? Oh, um... Tina, talk to that other one. Hi, I'm Dottie. Florence. That looks gooey. Mommy? Dear, grown-ups are talking. Ooh, that looks yucky. Mom! Oh, I never get to have an adult conversation with an adult. Oh, I don't know where I put it all. Do you? No, I don't know where you put it all. I meant you. Where you put it. Yes, I know where I put it all. Anyway, my husband's in the trophy business. You know, best this, first prize that, take a statue, put it on your mantle, brag! Oh, he makes them. For good money. Really good money. Of course, it's a lot of responsibility, and there's not a lot of spare time to spend with me. Hmm, well, there must be a lot of competition out there. Must be. So, your child, Tina, looks familiar. Go outside and play with this other child, dear. Mom, do I have to? Yes. That's my daughter. <laughs> I know. I can tell the kids apart. Come on, let the adults talk now. With my husband's schedule, we couldn't even have our own child. We had to buy Tina from the No Hearts when they had identical twins. I see. That's why I've seen Tina with another mother. Right? So embarrassing. I wish the other one would just die. Oh, well, that's... No, not really. Of course, it's just such a small town, though. Oh, I am stuffed. I should go to the bathroom. It's so dark in here. I'm cold. Oh, well, I won't be in here for long. I'll just go right out and get myself another husband. Oh, my God, this is so humiliating. No! Florence, please. You left Roger, not the other way around. You got to do the humiliating. I didn't... I didn't humiliate Roger. Right. So he's letting you see your child more than one Sunday a month. Well, no. Humiliated... What are those? Zebras. What do they do? Nothing. They, they stand there and look nice. No, they don't. Yes, they do. Look. See, it works! Are you mad at me? No. Why? Nothing. You know the Reverend's comment. I don't remember a comment. That he's more attracted to me than you. Oh, Donnie. He never... During the sermon, he called me pretty. When? He didn't even look at you. He didn't have to. He mentioned fat, and then he mentioned pretty. It was obvious what two people he was talking about. I'm not fat. You are. Don't call me fat. I didn't. I said you are. But I didn't use the word. Could have meant any word. That's sneaky. I don't know how I'm going to prove it, but I know that you called me fat just now. Okay, prove it. I said I can. Well, fine. Then don't be paranoid. I know I'm fat. I just don't want you calling me fat. It hurts my feelings. Okay, look. I'm sorry. I'm never going to forget never to call you that. Here, I'm making a note of it right now. See? There. Done. A big sale and Reverend Putty. Oh, how heavenly. Oh, there he is. I think I'll go walk by him and make his day. Hmm. Thought there'd be more women. Plenty of sweets. I don't know how Jesus stayed so scrawny, you know? Oh, look. It says faith. How fun for a cookie. It's not a library, ma'am. <laughs> Betsy. <sighs> oh. Oh, Florence, <gasps> pull yourself together. It's embarrassing enough to be your friend. Dottie, we are not friends. 